A robot that delivers essentials to seniors, the first of its kind in Singapore's public housing. It's able to use lifts on its own and navigate narrow corridors. The trial involves some households in one block. If successful, it could feature in neighbouring flats and even in a different estate. The social service agency behind this initiative says this could help alleviate challenges like limited resources and manpower as Singapore fast approaches a super-aged society. Lauren Ong reports. Meet the new kid on the block in Queenstown. Social service agency Lions Befrienders has a unit on the ground floor as it prepares a robot for deliveries. It's called Aiden for short and it's making visits to some seniors to pass them items like food, groceries and medicine. Slow and steady, but it's more independent than most, as it can do this. Well, the whole journey might come with obstacles, especially navigating narrow corridors common in HDB flats like this one. So when it encounters a resident, it will step aside before continuing its journey when the coast is clear. Aiden can even backtrack to give way to those requiring more space. And when it arrives at the intended recipient, a quick QR code does the trick. Food is delivered to me twice a day. So it's very convenient actually. If, they, if, they, if there's a door-to-door -door delivery, of course it's very convenient. I, and, uh, but uh, of course we have to be prepared for times when somehow the person couldn't turn up, you see, because I think they're using volunteers to deliver food. You see. If needed, the agency can also check up on the seniors if a quick conference call. It frees us at least 44 hours per month for our colleague to do more in-depth engagement with the seniors. So we can do therapy work, we can do engagement. What we want to do is to make lives easier for all the existing seniors so that they can age well at home, in their own homes, in the HDB, in the life environment. For now, Aiden will be sticking to this neighbourhood. It's still taking baby steps as it tries to master the neighbouring slopes and uneven terrain. If the six-month pilot goes well, it could be expanded to those in Tampanese.